So you just got a Pomeranian pup and thinking about potty training him? Well, if so, here are some tips to help you out. This video will provide you with information on the best way to get your palm accustomed to his new surroundings and ways to introduce him or her to the idea of going outside for bathroom breaks. 1. Choose the designated area. This is the first thing that you should do, do not allow your pup to go potty wherever there is space. A designated area should be chosen which should be at least an 8 to 10 foot diameter. You should bring your palm to this designated place every time. 2. Patience is a virtue. Potty training can take weeks or months depending on your dog. It is much easier to potty train a puppy than it is to train an adult dog because puppies are more susceptible to learning new things than adult dogs are. Be sure that you do not give up on teaching your Pomeranian pup to use the potty. You can make this work if you have patience and a little effort in training the dog. 3. Consistency is the best policy. Be consistent in everything you do with your dog. If you introduce a new potty behavior, like going outside, every time the dog has an accident, he will get used to that new thing and forget about using his potty. If you are consistent, he will eventually understand that going outside is where he needs to go when he wants to go. 4. Reward your palm whenever it poops outside. Always praise and reward your palm whenever he poops outside. If you don't, he will think it's okay to go inside. If you do reward him with a treat whenever he uses the bathroom outside, he will understand that this is what he's supposed to do rather than going inside. 5. Positive reinforcement works best. Never punish your dog for having accidents inside. If you do, he will either become afraid of you or think that you are punishing him every time he goes to the bathroom. If you always use positive reinforcement when he does his business outside, he will soon learn what is right and wrong. 6. Be with your dog whenever possible. A wonderful and clever way of doing this is to attach the dog's leash to your waist. A leash attached to your dog prevents them from getting into trouble and makes them stay close to you. Puppies can still have accidents after training is done due to a variety of reasons. It's common. Submissive urination is an example of when dogs urinate while they're feeling anxious or excited. Most dogs get over this in around 18 months. If you socialize your pup properly, they'll overcome this faster. 7. Crate training is useful if you are unable to actively supervise your palm. Crates can be great if you're unable to look after your pup all the time, but should only be used for short periods. Introduce your dog to the crate gently so that he enjoys being inside. Open the box and temptingly let them get a whiff of its features first. Never force your dog into the crate. Once our dog has finished checking out the crate, give him a treat. For extra measure, put another treat inside the crate and make your palm relaxed inside his or her new and comfy home. Don't lock your puppy in its crate for more than 5 hours. That may be too long for a young dog and lead to separation anxiety. 8. Limit access to preferred locations. Let your dog slowly make himself at home by introducing various parts in the house with guidance of supervision. Don't allow your dog to move freely around your house when you first get them. 9. Do not punish your puppy if it relieves itself in your house. Accidents will happen, you should never punish your dog for that, because it can only worsen the situation. Be patient and train them perfectly not to have accidents inside the house. Pomeranian Potty Training Schedule Begin Pomeranian house training as soon as you get your pup home. Dogs react to odors, and they will pee where there is the smell of dog urine. Eliminate unpleasant odors from your dwelling by utilizing a solution of white vinegar. Always take your dog outside to poop after playing, meals and taking naps. Also take him out before bedtime and every two hours for a two-month-old, every three hours for a three-month-old, etc. If you catch your pup about to pee inside immediately yell no and take him outside to the potty place. Conclusion Potty training is difficult, but it is a rewarding duty which one must undertake as a dog owner. If you follow these points correctly, your dog will be well controlled in no time. The most special benefit is that the house, too, will stay neat.